I found your purse and I just wanted to return it to you. Oh my goodness. I thought I have lost this forever. I'm just glad I was able to get it back to you. You know, before someone else could take it. I have something to give you for bringing my purse back. A check of one million dollars. One million dollars? Mom, where were you? I'm gonna be late. Hey, Ryan, I'm sorry. I had to pick up another shift at the hospital. Allie, honey, it's time for your medication. Coming. Hey, where, where are Ellie's pills? What? Where are, where are Ellie's pills? Wait, I thought you I, had them. I don't know where... Oh, Mom, hey, right sweet. here. How are you feeling? Good. Thanks, Ryan. Yeah. Okay. There are no pills. What? Nope. Ah, oh, shoot, I forgot to go to the pharmacy yesterday. Allie, I'm so, so sorry, sweetie. It's really okay, Mom. <sighs> shoot. You know what? Um. I'll go to the pharmacy after work. Are you sure? Yeah. Oh my gosh, thank you so much, Ryan. I love you so much. What would I do without you? I'm gonna go take a shower. Okay. You have a good day at work, okay? Okay. And you, I will make you whatever you want for dinner as soon as I'm done. Okay. Thanks, Thanks Mom. Soon. Are you in a lot of pain? No, I'm okay. You don't have to lie to me, Allie. I'm not mom. My leg really hurts, but I'll be okay. I think you're the strongest person I know. I wish I was stronger. I'm, you know, I'm really sorry about what happened. You know, all these bad things keep happening to us, Dad. Leaving us was bad enough. Now the car accident. It does seem like we've had a lot of bad luck lately. But it'll be okay, Ryan. The doctor said once I get the surgery, I'll be up and walking again in no time. You're always so optimistic. That's because I believe in karma. If you're a good person, good things will happen to you too. I'm gonna try to be more like you. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna be late. All right, love you, Allie. Love you. See you later. later. Bye, Mom. Love you. Hey, yo, Ryan. Hey, Kyle. You know, what's up, bro? You want to come play basketball or something? Um, I can't. Uh, I've got to go to work. Man, it sucks that you had to get a job. I know, but, you know, I got a job so I could help my mom with Allie's surgery. I mean, come on, you know how expensive it is. Yeah, but you never have time to hang out anymore. Wait, hey look, some lady left her purse. Let me see that. Hey, uh, what are you doing? Seeing if there's any money, duh. I don't think you should be going through that. I mean, what if the owner comes back looking for it? Oh, jackpot. Bro, there's like 2,000 bucks in here. Let's split it. I mean, don't you think that we should be turning this into the police or something? Are you serious? I mean, that's someone else's money. Yeah, but it, it belonged to Roberta Johnson. And now it belongs to us. But, I mean, I don't know. Like, what if she really needed that money? If she needed it that badly, she shouldn't have left it here in the first place. She's probably loaded and hasn't even realized that it's missing. But this is stealing. Don't be such a boy scout. Think how much you can do with a thousand dollars. Yeah, but I don't know. This, this feels wrong. Think about it. You can help pay your mom for Allie's treatment. You know how long it will take you to save a thousand dollars at your stupid job? Probably weeks, maybe even months. Yeah, you're making some good points here. <laughs> That's because I'm a genius. Hey, you wanna go get a pizza? You're always so optimistic. That's because I believe in karma. If you're a good person, good things will happen to you too. I'm gonna try to be more like you. Ugh! I can't do this. Why not? Because if I show up at my house with a thousand dollars, my mom is going to know I stole it. And I can't betray her and Allie like that. We have to return the purse. It's the right thing to do. Okay, don't you want your sister to get better? This could help pay for the surgery. Of course I wanna help Allie. But I can do it the honest way, by working at my job and saving up. What about me? 
I need this money too. I'm sure my boss will hire you. Let me talk to him. Then we can work together and you can earn yourself some money. What type of friend are you? You don't care about me. Bro, it's been like two weeks since I've had a decent meal. We almost got evicted last night. Okay, yes, of course I care about you, but I also care about being a good person. What if, what if I just take the money for myself? I mean, finders keepers, right? Yes, I know what finders keepers means. And since I'm the one that found the purse, I get to decide what to do with it. What are you gonna do? Fight me? I can call the police and tell them that you stole the money. What type of friend are you? You're willing to call the cops on your best friend? I don't want to, but I will if I have to. You just want all this for yourself, don't you? I would never do that. I mean, come on, you know me. I'm just trying to do the right thing. Please give me the purse. Fine, take it. Hope it was worth losing your friendship over it. Kyle, come on, don't be so dramatic. Come back and we can both return it. Can I help you? Hi, ma'am. Is your name uh, Roberta Johnson? Yes. Hi, um, I found your purse and I just wanted to return it to you. Oh my goodness. I thought I have lost this forever. You know, I was just, you know, walking to work and, you know, I just happened to see it on a park bench. It's all here. I can't believe it. It's all here. I'm just glad I was able to get it back to you, you know, before someone else could take it. Young man. I'm so grateful to you. Can I give you something as a thank you? No, 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 it's okay. I just wanted to make sure you got it back. I'm sorry, it's just, I, I really need this money. My daughter is sick and it's for her treatment. I thought I was not gonna be able to pay for her medication. I know exactly how you feel. My sister, she has health problems. She was injured in a car crash and, you know, she's supposed to get treatment, surgery, and it's just, it's all really expensive. I'm glad you can help your daughter now. What's your name? Ryan Davis. Well, Ryan Davis, you do save a very sick little girl. God bless you. Can I give you a hug? Hey, Ryan. I just got a strange call from a woman named Roberta. Do you know her? Roberta, no. Roberta Johnson? Oh, yeah, I know her. She asked if you could stop by her house. Who is she? She sounds a little too old to be your girlfriend. Ew! Mom! No, 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 no. Um, no. She's this lady that I helped. Um, she left her purse at the park. Um, and I returned it. Um, it was like a couple months ago. Oh, okay. Well, she lives right around the corner. Why don't you just go swing by there now before it gets dark and I'll keep playing with Allie. Okay. Bye, Allie. Bye, Mom. Bye. See you Bye. later. My turn? Hi, Ryan. Hey, Mrs. Johnson. Um, my mom told me you wanted me to come over. Yes. I have something for you for bring back my purse. A check of one million dollars. One million dollars? Yes. Just for bringing back your purse? This is, this is too much. I can't, I can't take it. Of course you can. I want you to have it. So, let's go tell your family the good news. Yes, let's go. Let's go. Hey, mom, I'm hey, home. Hey, bud. Who's your friend? Oh, uh, this is Roberta Johnson. Hi, it's nice to meet you. Davis, your son is such an honest and kind boy. Thank you so much. A few weeks ago, I left my purse on a park bench. My daughter was sick and I was so frustrated that I just forgot it. But Ryan, he found my purse and he brought back with all the money inside. And there wasn't a cent missing. And I used that money to help my daughter to get better. 
Ryan, I'm so proud of you, bud. That's amazing. Well, someone very wise told me to always do the right thing. When Ryan told me a little about his sister and said about her health, I knew I have to do something to help. I started a GoFundMe page to raise a few dollars, but the word got out about Ryan kindness, and guess what? We raised one, $1 million. million dollars. What? I know. Oh my gosh, this is amazing, but I, I can't take this. It's too much. It's not for me to take. The people raised this money because of Ryan's kindness. Thank you so much, Mrs. Johnson. Just promise me you continue being a kind and honest boy, okay? Yes, ma'am, I will. Ryan, I'm so proud of you. Thank you. Oh my gosh, we get to finally pay for Allie's surgery. I know, Allie, oh my gosh, look at this check. Honey, we can finally pay for your surgery now. Everything's gonna be okay. I'll be able to walk again. Yes, you will, baby. Ryan used the GoFundMe money to pay for Allie's surgery. The surgery was a success and Allie was able to walk in no time. Later, Kyle apologized to Ryan for being so inconsiderate. Ryan accepted the apology and they continue to be best friends till this day. And remember guys, you should always do the right thing, even when it's hard. Thank you guys for watching this video. Please leave a like and subscribe to the channel to see more videos like these. And remember, here at Generation Hope, we're trying to make the world a better place, one story at a time.